important things for your job and the task at hand. Just uh, like we've learned the last three weeks, um, we can do the same thing. Uh, more so this week. Okay, Carol, along those lines, in what ways have you seen this? This is a young team, began the year very inexperienced. In what ways have you seen this team kind of grow and mature over the last few weeks? Uh, we've come together. Uh, I mean, it's a self-inflicted wound. Those, those mistakes that you know we can control. Uh, you know, we've done our job better. And get better each week and to improve. That's what the good teams do. What kind of atmosphere are you expecting? Uh, what kind of vibe? What kind of scene are you expecting over there? A playoff atmosphere. Uh, this game means a lot to both teams. Uh, looking at the bigger picture, you know, we talk about the same purpose. Uh, there's no hiding it. How much this one really means. How do you expect the Steelers to possibly defend you differently have very, since you beat them just two weeks? Um, you know, they had success there in the middle of the game. We really had that offensive ball, so I expect some of the same things. Uh, they played uh, well offensively last week. They were a lot of bad coverage. Do you think you could influence uh, Fitzpatrick moves based on using Hunt and Chubb and things in the pre-snap motion? Uh, yeah, he's a guy that they give him a lot of freedom to play. Uh, so just seeing formationally how we can uh, mess around with them, see how they're playing it. Uh, yeah, but having both backs in there at the same time kind of makes them you know, show their hand. Freddie mentioned some stats where Pittsburgh's numbers are way different at home than on the road. When you're watching film, does that stand out to you, especially defensively for them? Yeah, they really feed off the energy of the crowd at home. Uh, Set the stat was 30 and 38 of their sacks were at home. Uh, so that just goes to show they, they feed up that momentum. Uh, they play well at home, so we have to do our job. And then how tough is it, or how important is it then to protect you, especially with Greg Robinson maybe not being out there? Uh, yeah, it's the same focus every week, protecting our football, uh, you know, penalty free, that singular focus mindset, uh, just amping it up a little bit more. Given the fact that uh, four Browns hits from that last game were fine, you know, they knocked Juju out. They knocked Deontay out. Uh, there were three helmets on the Do you think that their defense is going to have a little extra for you guys based on some of that kind of stuff? We'll see. Uh, we have to do our job first and foremost, and they have to do theirs uh, in the lines of football, and I expect it to be a, a pretty tightly called football game, just knowing what happened a couple weeks ago. So we'll find out. It seemed the 